The youngest undisputed champion, Devon the Dream Any. He take to X, popular known as Twitter. And this is what Devon Any have to say. I gave you all three months. The game ain't been the same. Both time I come back. Humble Allah. Guys from Devon Any make this tweet. There is a lot of chattering online. Wondering who Devon Any going to make his ring return against. Couple name also throw out there. I heard a Marius Barrios name out there. And I also heard a Isaac Pitbull Cruz. And also the guy that win Devon Any vacate WBC belt. You know that Devon Any was champion in recess. So that guy that beat Russell Brother, his name out there as well. A couple other people name. But guys, if you ask me who I would love to see Devon May Any make his ring return against is Little Tang Tank. I believe Devon Any must get right back on Tank Davis and continue to press Tank Davis. I know Devon Any was pressing out Tank Davis very hard for a fight at 135. But guys, Devon Any need to press Tank Davis right now because remember guys, everybody did believe that Isaac Pitbull Crew is going to beat that Ryo guy that he fought the other day. And Word on the street, the um, if when when Pitbull Cruz beat that Raya guy, Pitbull Cruz and Javante Tank Davis going to fight. And you know that Pitbull Cruz he fought at 140, so there is no excuse talking about Devon Ennis too big for Tank Davis because Tank Davis planned to fight Pitbull at 140. So why Tank Davis cannot fight Devon Any at 140? The reason why I want Devon Any to get right back on Tank and press Tank out for a fight because remember you know, guys when Devon Any did, did get defeat by Ryan Garcia before they know that Ryan Garcia popped dirty Tank Davis was so happy I never see this in my life a black dude happy for our next black dude to get um, defeated by a dirty Mexican Tank Davis was so happy because he believed he get Devon Any off of his back Tank Davis even pull up bro how oh, people support Tank Davis? How oh, people don't see that Tank Davis is the biggest P-U-S-S-Y in boxing? Tank Davis pull up on Devon Any at the club when Ryan Garcia beat Devon Any. Say Ryan Garcia beat Devon Any fair and square before the, the PD and all those things come out. Because Tank Davis was celebrating, oh, the drinks is on us. We're going to go out and we're going to party for our victory. Tank Davis pull up on Devon Any at a club. So now Tank Davis is free. Tank Davis was pretending like he's want to fight with Devon Any when he knew that Devon Any just lost to Ryan Garcia. I mean, a devastating loss before they know that that dirty bastard Mexican, you know, was dirty. You understand me? Tank Davis was out there celebrating Ugga Brian Garcia and all those bullshit. But no, y'all, you know that Tank Davis have a lot of protector out there. And people might say, oh, Dev I know that Tank Davis protector, they're gonna say, oh, Tank Davis will knock out Devon Any. Tank Davis will put Devon Any to sleep. He couldn't he couldn't even get out of the, the left hook of Ryan Garcia. That's all Tank Davis protector do. Talk what Tank Davis would do. And they never yet said, let's fight. Tank Davis, go and knock out Devon Any. But they crypto in the comment section. Oh, Tank Davis would knock Devon Any out. Tank Davis would knock Devon Any out. Devon Any don't have a chin. Devon Any couldn't, couldn't even sleep Ryan Garcia left hook. But you never hear them said, Tank Davis, fight Devon Any. They, they don't have no money excuse. They cannot say Devon Any don't sell. Because Tank Davis never fight no one that sell like Devon Any before. So they cannot say, they cannot talk about no sell thing and no pay per view thing. Because guess what? Turkey Alashik is interested in that fight. And you cannot, and nobody on this planet can question Turkey Alashik money. 
because he, he put on the biggest boxing event in history with Deontay Wilder on a card, Anthony Joshua on the same card, Joseph Parker, even that Bible guy on the card, Sanchez, Big Baby Joel Miller, Danny Dubois. Can I name more? All of these guys is main event. And Turkey Aloshi put on every single one of them together. So who is little tang tang for Turkey Aloshi pay? So guys, you don't come in don't come under this video talking about Devanini don't sell. And Devanini is not a draw. Because when he come on to Turkey Aloshi, he don't care about those self hating monkey racist talking pint that you guys always said. I want Devon Any to get right back on Tank Davis. He got he, Tank Davis have no excuse, no way to run. Devon Any is coming back and Shakira Stevenson is out there as well. And the both of them back by Turkey Aloshi. Turkey Aloshi is back in Shakira Stevenson and Turkey Aloshi is back in Devon the Dream Any. So where Tank Davis gonna run now? Where are you gonna hide? What you Tank Davis protector going to say? There is no more excuse. Tank Davis have to fight a Devon Haney or a Shakira Stevenson. That weak ass dude. Man, I don't know people support Tank Davis. I mean, it's so strange to me. This dude don't even want to mention Shakira Stevenson's name. Although you know how I feel about Shakira Stevenson. Shakira Stevenson want to be Tank Davis' friend. But when you come on to Devon Haney, I can put my pot on the fire. Devon Haney is going to press Tank Davis. He's going to press Tank Davis for a fight. I mean, I'm not sure about Shakira Stevenson. But I know Shakira Stevenson would take the fight still. But I mean, I don't know. He just seems like he wants to be friends with Tank Davis more than he wants to fight Tank Davis. But later for Shakira Stevenson. But I still like him and I still, you know, rock with him. I love how he box. But Devon Haney is back. So guess what, guys? I am back on the Devon Haney train. I mean, I never hop off of Devon Haney train, you know, but, you know, he's been going through a lot, a lot, and these races and these self-hating black monkey online, you know, all kind of means and, you know me I say, these people just make me sick, I'm telling you. The way all these people treat Devon Haney, the best 135 pound in the world, it's crazy, guys, but guess what? Devon Haney said something in that ring that night when he he thought that he lost to Ryan Garcia, fair and square. He said, Allah know what's Allah is a perfect planner. And you see that now? You see now, guys? Where is that dirty bastard cheating, dirty Mexican Ryan Garcia? Where, where are you now? Where is he now? Where is he now? He probably in a crack house or, or somewhere in a dungeon. I told you guys, I cursed Ryan Garcia with the answers of spirit. And you believe it's a joke. Ryan Garcia will never. Fight back in a professional boxing ring. But that's sanctioned by the boxing board. I don't, I don't care about those exhibitions and all those things. But, but a sanctioned fight, Ryan Garcia will never ever fight again. He will never be the same. I'm telling you, for what he done to Ryan Gar for what he done to Devon Haney. I curse him with the ancestor spirit. He will never ever be the same again. I mean, in life, he's he he gonna be miserable for the rest of his life I mean he's oh, he gonna be haunted by his own shadow I promise you that guys but guys Devon Haney if you're watching this video right now get right back on Tank Davis press him out because when he thought that you lost to Ryan Garcia he was out here paraded with Ryan Garcia pull up on you at a club why he never why t how, people, how people respect Tank Davis why Tank Davis never pull up on Devon Any when Devon Any was calling him out when Devon when Devon Any was hunting down Tank Davis for years at 135. Why Tank Davis never pull up on Devon Any before? Why when Devon Any lost to Ryan Garcia when they think that Devon Any lost to Ryan Garcia, that is the time when Tank Davis want to pull up. He was so loud and vulgar and this and that I was talking about Devon Any don't fall. But when he know that Ryan Garcia when he find out that Ryan Garcia popped dirty. And they removed Devon a loss from his record. You don't hear nothing from little Tang Tang. That's why nobody can tell me that Tank Davis' daddy is a black man. I believe Tank Davis' daddy is a white man. 
it is what it is guys but guys if you want if you ask me who i want devon Nene to fight next lick a tank tank because i believe devon Nene can whoop tank davis ass nothing gonna be gonna change for devon Nene. this this what happened to devon Nene. a lot of people is question devon any like or you gonna look is punch resistant is confident i'm telling you devon Nene gonna come back better than before i mean this is a this is a purification for devon Nene. it's like a gold that go through a fire when it come out of the fire it gonna be so amazing i promise you that guys devon Nene is another level is another journey in his career and i and i'm saying it now today is what the 14th month of august devon Nene going to break money me radio record 50 1 and 0 oh. remember i told you that first is what it is guys thank you so much for watching